my log branch my branch. Crews chip away at three large trees, horizontal in Ken Shaman's yard. Completely gone. Nothing, just right out, right out of the ground. Nothing left to him. The ficuses belong to him. Big, big, big tree. They've been there, I think my wife said, about, about 25 years. But those mighty giants, no match for an angry, swirling tornado. My car is getting destroyed right now, man. Justin Kernan capturing the mighty monster as it tore through Not North good. River shores, ripping shingles off roofs, upending mailboxes, flipping this RV upside down. Creating intermittent damage along that path from about 95 to where we're standing today. The National Weather Service's Will Ulrich telling me the EF0 tornado traveled for about eight miles, ending in Ken's front yard just feet from his home. It sounded like a train. It was going... And I, I was actually in an inside closet in my bedroom. Across the street, as Dave Nuffley cleans his yard up too. Yeah, that, that's going to be a several day job. He considers himself lucky. Walking me through the path of Came havoc, right there. it passed right by his home, somehow taking only his lawn furniture with it. Kind of knocked this tree over a little bit. I went straight up the side of the house and across the street. Barbara Osborne saw it go over her house. We knew it was coming because we'd been watching Steve Wiggle the whole time, start to finish from like five o'clock on. Lucky to have escaped its whirling wake without damage. It was swaying around like one of those balloon guys outside of a car dealership. Glenn Hart's front tree. You can actually see where it cracked in half. Succumb to its ferocious force. Right there, Gosh. but nobody got hurt. The house didn't get hurt, so. Now it's just clean up and that's fine by me. Now as they all pick up the pieces, fear starting to finally fade, come storm clouds again shaping, Mother Nature back for more. And that's all coming through this area again today. I'm like, oh God. I never had fear before. And now it's like, oh my geez. Hopefully it comes through and we don't get any more damage.